Usually in the morning hours when we are ready to load. Before we load, we usually plug our Sub-Zero units in along with this power cord. And we have a receptacle here that we plug in on the side. Once we plug that in, that unit is ready to go. It's pretty much cool on the inside. And if you follow me here, this is the crates that I was describing to you guys about as far as uh, the meals and the, the uh, refrigeration unit is just pretty much blowing the cold air on the meals, which keeps the meals really cold. They'll pretty much just stay frozen once we set the temperature inside. And to the rear is where we keep our uh, Cambro units. This is the Cambro unit. This is what keeps our hot meals hot. And I'll open it up to make and let you see exactly this is what the Hot Meals actually looks like. And there's a, a oven, it's actually an oven, it keeps it warm. This is the actual heating element here. Actually, this is the control to turn on the refrigeration unit. Once we start the van, we just turn this unit on. It reads out the temperature here to let us know uh, what the temperature is inside of the uh, box. The temperature will con continue to drop down once it's set on the uh, actual actually 30. To other Meals on Wheels organization, you pretty much can control your temperatures, provide safe and nutritious meals to your clients. And I believe they will be very happy with hot and cold meals. Mm -hmm.